Hello, this is the Watchdog, and welcome back to Fun with Watches. If watches weren't fun, you'd only need one. This time, we're going to do something a little bit different. Instead of a usual watch review or unboxing video, we're going to do a episode called Please Buy My Stranger Things Watch. Let's start off the wrist check. I'm wearing a Pagani Design PD1782. And Greg was wearing a Pagani Design PDYS008. I asked Grogu how many credits did they raise for Princess Leia's campaign from the Yoka No-No concert. He said 20,000 credits. I said, wow, that's a lot of credits. People must really like her singing. He said, you don't understand how a Yoka No-No concert works. They pay her not to sing. Okay, I have this Stranger Things watch. I reviewed it. And I've been trying to sell it ever since I reviewed it. And nobody will buy it. When I first started my channel, I realized that I could sell my watches on Facebook Marketplace when I was done with them at a minimal loss. Well, unfortunately, lately, I haven't been selling very many watches at all. I don't know if the, mark watch, if the watch market has dried up or what, but this Stranger Things watch has been sitting on Marketplace forever. And I keep lowering the price, lowering the price, and nobody wants it. And when I started my channel, I tried to do it anonymously. Uh, but I was selling my watches, though, on my own personal Facebook profile. I never created a separate profile for fun with watches. So whenever someone would ask me, where are you selling your watches? I would just kind of say Facebook Marketplace and leave it at that. Because I really didn't want to reveal who I was. Well, I think that ship has sailed. I'm going to have to reveal who I am. And I'm going to leave a link in this video description of my Facebook profile so you can look for my watches. Right now, I have this watch listed for $30. But I have it also listed for free shipping. And so the shipping is $9.25. So basically, by the time I give Facebook their cut, I'm going to be getting less than $20 for this watch. And I paid $45 for it, so I'm going to take a serious loss. And also, if you don't like this watch here, because in all honesty, it's not a great watch, but it is worth the $30 I'm asking for. I have many other watches. I have this Pagani Design. I have this Caddison. I have this Tandario. So lots of watches for sale. I think altogether I have 12 for sale. Most watches, though, do not have free shipping. Basically, Facebook Marketplace, though, has pretty good shipping rates. For example, this measure here is fairly light. And even with box, it's less than a half a pound. So it's going to be $4 to ship in the United States. This Tandera, though, this is above a half a pound. This is between the half pound to one pound rate. So it's $5.75 to ship. And like I said, the strangest thing, because of the giant packaging, is $9.25 is the ship, but I'm including that shipping for free. Since all my watches are listed in Facebook Marketplace and shipped through the U.S. Postal Service, I'm pretty sure that you can only buy my watches if you live in the United States of America. So I know I have a lot of viewers that do not live in the United States, and I am sorry. I don't think you can purchase them. In all honesty, though, the shipping costs would just kill it. It would make it pointless. Why would you buy a watch and spend 30 to 40 bucks to ship it when you can get it from AliExpress for practically free shipping? It just doesn't make sense. Five dollars and twenty-five cents, or five dollars and seventy-five cents, or four dollars, is much more reasonable. 
And one nice thing is you will get the watch a little bit quicker than you would get through AliExpress. Plus, you would be helping out my channel. Once again, I do not make a profit on this channel. I am just trying to minimize my loss. And right now, I am selling a lot of watches at a pretty good loss here. But this Timex, though, I've been having it for sale forever. And yes, it's not a great watch, but it is a fun watch. And so it would be great if somebody would just buy it from me. And thank you again. I will leave a link to my Facebook profile in the description. And I will not leave links, though, to each individual item. You can just search on my profile for the watches I have. That way, when a watch is purchased, I don't have to go back and delete it from the description. Okay, well, thank you very much for watching my little spiel here. And once again, this would really help out the channel if people could buy some of my inventory. And then I'll be able to buy more watches for review. Bye.